you must be so sensitive. And I'm like, no, I'm not. You think too much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Such a Pisces. <laughs> glub glub. <laughs> feelings hurt, feelings hurt. <laughs> I'm Danielle, I do too much. I like hair, talking, cosplay, music, art, and stuff. I'm Danielle, welcome to Star Puppy. I've always been very skeptical of Pisces and horoscopes and like moons and suns and Venuses and all of that. And I wanted to put this kind of stuff to the test because I'm tired of telling people that I'm Pisces and they're like, oh no, you must cry every day. You must be so sensitive. And I'm like, Let's take the test, shall we? Just pull up a chair and like and subscribe if you like how weird I am already. And if you just want to see some more. Usually I do hair things and talking things, so you'll get a whole bunch of personality for your buck. Now we're on horoscope.com. Are you a true Pisces? You, blank, the world, want to rule, carry the weight of, hate, want the best for, want the best for. Something bad happens to you. You're most likely to think, why did this happen to me, usually? Your dream vacation would involve poolside retreat. It's only three questions long. Result, result, true Pisces. Let's just continue. You think too much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you think too much and feel too deeply. Hmm. I don't know what you mean. Like a true Pisces, you recognize this problem but refuse to change your essential nature. <laughs> you know what? That's not even true. Like, I desperately want to be a sociopath. <laughs> I don't want to feel anything. You put so much heart and spirit into your efforts that failure seems personal. Are you trying to be so mean to me, horoscope.com? Friends and family love how you immerse yourself in their lives. Co-workers and those in need feel the power of your passionate commitment. Yeah. When you decide something is yours, you'll take care of it forever. See, that gets me in trouble though. <laughs> I just get in so much trouble. <laughs> Let's take another one. Are you a real Pisces? According to mydailymoment.com. Okay, you've been waiting in the line at the grocery store for 15 minutes when the register breaks. You wait patiently, jeez. It's your best friend's birthday, you get her a small gift certificate. Do I love her? Nah, you get a cake. When you know someone is in pain, oh, see, that's a problem. <laughs> I will find you and I will fix you. You feel sad for the person, yeah. You are not affected one way or the other. How do people do that? And how can I join? Want to help her, try to make her feel better. Try to make her feel better. Doesn't everyone... Okay, just keep taking the quiz. Which vacation destination would you most like to visit? Yes, Fiji. Like those crystal freaking waters are like... Which of the following jobs would you most enjoy? Secretary? No. Customer service rep for charity? Charity? I'll go with charity because I like... Oh no, when someone criticizes you, you, it's the last one. Try your best to shake it off, although you usually fail. That one. Fun fact, did that today. <laughs> How often do you let people walk all over you? Um, more often than I'd like to admit, I usually still feel bad when I call someone out for being mean to me. Like, what did you Which of the following would you most like to receive from your mate? You to mate. Jewelry. But it's like passed down through generations. Like, 
you're giving me a piece of your family. Babe, if a loved one were very ill, you would visit as often as possible. Which best describes your feelings about a nine to five job? I'll die. I would hold one if I needed to. Uh, when it comes to money matters, which best describes your approach? I give extra money to my church. So that one. Which pet would you be most likely to choose? Probably like a pound puppy because like I want to save you. Like no one else will love you. I'll love you. Where would you most like to live? To be honest, in a city. I like a high rise condo. I don't think that's very Pisces of me, but I like hustle and bustle. Which snack is most appealing to you? Sushi? Sushi's a snack? Dried fruit. Cake isn't a snack. What's your party personality? Winston, if you're watching, fight me. I'm the good dancer. We gonna go with dancer. Results. Are you a real Pisces? You're a true Pisces. Okay. Congrats. I don't feel very lucky. You're a Pisces to the letter. You possess all of the characteristics of a Pisces. In general, Pisces are gentle, patient, and compassionate. They're often big-hearted to a fault, and they can be taken advantage of. They're free spirits and hate being confined, especially in the workplace. They possess the innate ability to help others in need. Instead of trying to change other people, they accept them for who they are and are more concerned with other people's problems than their own. <laughs> Pisces are also generous and love to share with their fellow man. Ugh. Romantic at heart, the Pisces loves to dream and enjoys being wooed, even if they later find they've been misled. Ugh. Okay. Subscribe. I'ma take one more. Where is this? Horoscopes.lovetoknow.com If you had the opportunity to live wherever you wanted, where would you choose to live? I would like to live in a big city with great restaurants, beautiful fountains, and cultural attractions. That one, that one, that one! Imagine you disagree with someone who has a strong opinion. How easy would it be for you to express an opposing opinion? <sighs> I have to admit, I would have a difficult time and I would probably wind up keeping my opinion to myself in order to avoid an argument. That one. You're at a karaoke bar and everyone is taking turns singing a song. Would you take a turn? Yes, I'd sing a song if- Oh, if everyone really encouraged me to do it. Yeah. What if you were having a conversation with someone and your intuition began telling you something about her? Would you continue to listen to your gut? Do you find that your hunches about people and situations are usually right? Yes. I almost always trust my gut intuition, so I'd probably follow it. My hunches are right a fair amount of the time. I might be a little off track on some details, but I'm usually not too far off. That one. You're sitting at a work-related seminar work, listening to a speaker who's been talking for half an hour straight about a rather boring subject. What's going on in your head? Paying attention and taking notes, but I'm doodling. Just a little bit. You have the perfect opportunity to take part in your favorite activities. What would you do? I'd most likely go to an art museum or the opera or ballet because at any opportunity I'm going to do that. A friend is going through a difficult time and clearly wants to talk about it. Let's talk about it for hours! I try to be kind but I also steer the conversation away from the problem because I'd rather not be in this situation. <laughs> I encourage her to talk about what's going on but I find myself getting upset for her even if I try to si find a solution for her problem. I'd be getting mad at uh, other people's problems, yeah that's it. I already know how this is gonna go. You and a group of friends make plans. You're really excited. You get together only to find they've decided to do something completely different without even consulting you. What do you do? Cry! Such a Pisces. I'm gonna go with it, but I'm gonna be kinda hurt about it. I go along with the new plans, but I might feel a little hurt that... You're in a relationship with someone you truly love, but things are getting difficult between the two of you. What do you do? I try to work things out between us, but there's a limit to how much I'm willing to do for the sake of a relationship. It would be great if we could stay friends, but I wouldn't want to have any ongoing conflicts. I'd... no. But, I mean, gosh, that sounds so healthy. <laughs> First one... If you could switch careers, which of these positions would appeal to you the most? Mmm... animals. Alright, result. You're a classic Pisces. Great. You 
have a truly classic Pisces personality. You're incredibly intuitive, mm -hmm, and your emotions run deep. You may be kind of shy around people you don't know well, but you're still the kind of friend everyone wants to have because you're a great listener and very supportive. I ain't shy though. <laughs> you also make a dependable partner. When you give your love and loyalty, you go all in. That's me. You feel drawn to the water. I'm not mad at the water. I'm not mad. Whether it means swimming or simply gazing at it from the shore. Ah, oh, crap. I love looking at water. I didn't know looking counted. Yeah, I'll stare at aquariums all d I'll stare at aquariums all d I feel real humble right now. While your dream world is your favorite place to be, you care about the world around you and try to help others whenever possible. I'm mad. <laughs> Such a Pisces. <laughs> Glove, glove. <laughs> feelings hurt, feelings hurt. <laughs> I don't know what to do with this information. Take more personality quizzes and do things that Pisces are supposed to do and do things that Pisces aren't supposed to do and see how I feel. Y'all gonna be interested? Cause I'm gonna do it. Literally pray for me. <laughs> I'm out here getting my feelings hurt every day. <laughs> Like and subscribe, cry with me, I am me therefore weird, and star puppy <laughs> away. <laughs> oh no. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I don't know what to do with this information.